Hey guys, it's Brenda from our Wee Reburns channel. I'm here today without a tripod, so please excuse the shaking that I may have, but I really want to come here and share with you that I am expecting an alternat alternative baby girl, and I can't wait to share her with you guys. Um, as you may know that, uh, <laughs> there has been a huge controversy online between the authentics and the replicas, but I want to talk about a time many years ago, many years ago, when I first entered this hobby, there was a huge thing about collecting alternative dolls. Um, so many things were said about these alternative dolls and how uh, I, I don't want to get into it but I do collect alternative dolls I do have many alternative dolls in my collection I've never really shown them on my channel except around Halloween because of the controversy that used to come around them um, I collect I have zombie dolls I have a vampire, I have a ghost doll, I have a mummy, I have like a mummy, a, not just a cute, yeah, anyways, my collection of alternative is huge, and I, I am so excited, I am receiving actually two alternative dolls in my collection, they will be Buddha inspired, <laughs> controversy right there to some but I do want to share with you all the beautiful things that I am having and prepared for them having do I even sound English oh my goodness <laughs> in preparation for her especially um, I she will have a theme I'm so excited she is going to have a swan theme and her brother that is also coming he is going to have a frog theme so they will share a pond uh, theme together I have many things that are coming because the thing is I knew this girl was coming her name I have a name picked out for her already and I guess I'll share with you because one of the things I have for her is a personalized blanket with her name on it so I can't wait for that so I have many things for her coming I still can't get into my dolly room with Jeremy here my hand is sore oh my goodness <laughs> I've never done this in a long time without a tripod my arm is killing me <laughs> but anyway she is beautiful I can't wait to share her with you and she remember she is alternative so she'll look different she d will have uh, facial tattoos on her she'll have tattoos on her arms her legs her feet um, so she is highly inspired by um, Anyways, so I'm not getting get into that for now, but I do want to share with you the beautiful... I had to change my arm. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I can't wait to share with you the things. Okay, this is a mess right now. I have a mess over there because they recently came in from Timu. I love Timu. Uh, I know a lot of people aren't really into Timu, but I use PayPal on Timu. So if people are worried about using their bank information, I totally trust PayPal. So I've been on Timu for since they came to Canada. I was right there ordering stuff. And I have so many things from Timu. But I want to share with you the beautiful things I have. To <laughs> my phone, my arm is just getting... Okay, I want to share with you these things. Yeah, I can turn the camera without... Okay, first of all, look how cute. Francis bought me this Always Here Care Bear. And I think I'll keep that one in the box. I want to start a collection of those. I know they're not the original Care Bears, but... 
I don't know. Maybe I will take them out of the box. I don't know yet. What do you guys think? Should I keep her in the box? But Francis liked this one because I have the heart. And he's always here. Okay, so here is her swan theme. I can't wait to share with you what I have so far for her. Um, this is a Swan Princess. That's her nickname, Swan Princess. And um, she is be being reborn by Daisy Skyheart. So, Daisy, thank you so much oh, for everything. Anyways, I, <laughs> I want to share with you the things for her. So, this is a tablecloth. And I thought it would be great for a backdrop for on the wall or as a curtain. It's only a tablecloth. Um, this is a beautiful dress from Timu. And um, oh, I just I can't wait for her to try it. This one might be a little bit too big on her, but I still can't I still can't wait. Um, this is a another dress from Timu. It's so, so beautiful. Oh, I can't wait to share her with you guys. She is beautiful. Um, originally, she was a, an Adora doll. So, she's an Adora sculpt that is being reborn by Daisy. So, anyways, I spo I am totally spoiling her. I bought her these beautiful lace head bows, headbands. To go with her beautiful dresses. Um, this is a bonnet. Oh, look, a lace bonnet. Oh, I can't wait. This one is a lace, another lace flowered headband. This one is another headband, but it's thicker, kind of like a like half bonnet, half headband. Oh, it's gonna look gorgeous. I kind of went overboard on these. Because they're so cheap. They're only like a dollar something. Uh, <laughs> this one is... Um, I wasn't sure to get whether like a, a, a diamond. Well, it's not diamonds. You know what I mean. <laughs> a sparkly kind like this. Or a pearl kind like this. So I bought one of each. And I guess I bought two of those. <laughs> by accident. Here is a swan stuffy is one princess stuffy this will be for her and i want to open it when she's here i actually want to wrap these up for her and do a celebration i could totally do that on camera oh i can't wait i can't wait for her she is so beautiful you guys i hope that you'll be here if you're into alternative dolls to see that but uh, well i guess you already know her presence <laughs> So I don't know if I'll be doing a video, but this blanket, oh, it's so, so, so soft. It's beautifully soft. It's personalized. And can we, first, this is on top. This is a pillowcase. I need to iron this, but it's this one princess pillow case. So I can add, you know that stuffing I took out from the pickle? Yeah, I could totally, I have more. <laughs> I have more dolls from um, AliExpress that need uh, a whole bunch of stuffing out. So I'm planning, like in that video, I said, I save this stuffing for pillows. Yeah, for stuff like this <laughs> from Team. Oh my goodness, I'm rambling. This is another beautiful, amazing, amazing dress for her. Oh, I can't wait. I can't wait. I can't wait. Okay. Here is that blanket. It's a swan princess, of course. That is her theme. And look how pretty they have, like, floral on here. Oh, my goodness. And here is her name. Are you ready? This is her name. Bonnie. Her name is Bonnie. So I can't wait for you guys to see Bonnie. She is so gorgeous. Alternative. <laughs> and I also bought her this because she is going to have a special spot in my dolly room. By the way, I do have a playlist of me creating a dolly room. 
but it's going to be completely different after Jeremy leaves I'm going to have an empty room again well kind of empty there's desks in there and furniture but I think I'll do another series of me putting together my new dolly room it will be different than when I had it because I have Bonnie will be in there she is going to have be the star of the room so this is a it's actually it's a, it's a tent like that I think it's really supposed to be for cats but so I might not use the door on here I don't know I didn't put it together I don't want to put it together until Jeremy is gone he is here for four more days so yes this weekend guys I can start to put my dolly room back together oh I'm so excited I'm so so excited so if you're wondering what this is this is a car seat that I keep in the living room always and I keep this on for dust and sun and the sun but right here is Kiriana oh she's so cute she is still the I changed her into her sleeper that she came with but she is safely tucked in here but okay these are these are earrings of swans I'm gonna turn them into a necklace for her I was thinking one for her and one for me but one for her for sure um Oh, and this is a bow that came with that dress, that green dress I showed you. I know I have stuff hiding in here so that mojo might, our dog won't get at them. Um, where is it? I'm not left handed. This is a bracelet of Swan Love. So, I thought I could use these beads and these, um, I'm either going to use this as whole and keep it as part of her uh, decor or I'm going to take these apart and turn them into necklaces and a plastic clip using these beads. I don't know yet. I haven't decided yet. Um, okay, there is another thing I got for her. Oh, yes. I made sure because my sons are still here and they, I had to I bought this from Timu because Mojo, which is right here, she has been marking up the couch with her wet paws. Hi, Mojo. Is my fairy princess. And oh, I got this really cute doll from Timu, too. She is so cute, but her teeth. I might take some white nail polish. And, but she is so cute. She's a little mini doll and her joints move. Oh, she's so cute. I love her. Okay, this is a total mess. I have one of these hair things. <laughs> have you ever tried one of these hair things? They're so fun. This is that doll I made. That, that accessory doll I made. Here's, I used to sell Avon. I got some awards for selling Avon. There's some more of my fairy girls. But right here, I keep very safe. This is swan glass figurine. So that's for Bonnie. I just keep it safe. Yeah, she is silicone. Her dress lights up. So pretty. <laughs> so, yeah. So I can't wait for you guys to meet her. Oh, my hair is tickling my face. Ah. <laughs> Anyways, guys, thank you so much for being here. I can't wait for you to see Bonnie and her brother. Remember, they are alternatives. So if you're not into alternative, you don't have to watch. I don't expect you to watch. But I just remember hiding a lot of my alternative dolls. But no more. I love them all. They're too beautiful. They're too cute. Um, I showed Molly. She is my zombie doll on oh, All Dolls Matter group on Facebook, uh, Stephanie's group, and I received so much love from the post I did. Molly is inspired by my great 
great uncle, no, my great uncle Reggie, my dad's uncle, he was born with um, Down syndrome. So my Molly is a zombie Down syndrome doll, the patient's kit, I'm pretty sure. Um, she was reborn by Candy Love Sparkle on YouTube. She's amazing at doing alternative. I own many of her alternative dolls. Many, many, many. And I love them all. Anyways, Molly is inspired from my great uncle Reggie because of the horrors that he went through uh, living with Down syndrome back in the 1920s, the 1900s, the early 1900s. People didn't understand Down syndrome and they seriously thought he was a crazy. He was like, they thought he was crazy. Uh, they, they didn't have him killed because, oh, sorry. <clears throat> a lot of people were killed when they had handicaps like that. My family was ridiculed for, for loving him. Having him home, have him work on the farm. <sighs> he was teased a lot, bullied a lot. His life was threatened a lot. So my Molly zombie is, is, represents for him. Anyways, here I am just blabbering. Because I never did a video in a long time, but I can't wait for you guys to see Bonnie. She is beautiful. She is stunning and I can't wait for you to meet her and I hope that she wants to be on camera because her mommy is a youtuber <laughs> anyways guys thank you so much for being here and until next time very very soon bye guys bye chat guys high five bye guys love you bye guys bye have a good day